Hi, I'm Quentin Young, and this is Second Story Garage. We're here with Brian Samuels and Russell Olmsted, and they are the bass and the guitar player for Ultraviolet Hippopotamus, and they're from Grand Rapids, and they came to visit us today. And so tell me about the scene. We were talking a little bit before now about uh, the scene in Grand Rapids. What's the scene like? Who do you like to listen to out there? Um, there there's tons of great music coming out of Michigan. Mm -hmm. uh, we got lots of good friends that are bands that are touring all over the place as well, but they, their home base is in Michigan, like the Ragbirds, Green Sky Bluegrass, uh, the Mac Pods. Function. Uh, Functions, one of our friends, Four Finger Five. Rest in peace, guys. Yeah, they just played their last show. Uh, yeah, yeah. I'm just announced. Well, it's coming up. Yeah. I haven't done it yet, but uh, uh, and Grand Rapids itself, I mean, is just awesome. Uh, in the last ten years, especially, like it's stepped up. We've got a lot of good venues, uh, lots of good music supporters, and I mean, just the town in general. Just the arts are flourishing there right now. And it's, yeah, mm -hmm. it's good. It's a good spot to be. It's a good time to be there. Yeah, there's a lot of people uh, investing in downtown Grand Rapids to to bring out the arts. There's a thing called Art Prize that happens there every year where they, they hand out about, I think it's $250,000 to the first prize winner for uh, artists from all around the world will submit their stuff, including performance artists and musicians, and uh, people vote on the on the best art and the prize is handed out from there. So you get tens of thousands of people come in for it. Now you guys play uh, jam. You guys play jam music, jam rock. And um, you, some of your songs are very intricate. I'm interested to hear how that happens. How do, does, does one person write the material and teach it to other people? Do you put that all together yourself? It really, it really depends on the song. Yeah. Um, and, I mean, Brian and Dave uh, Sanders, our keyboard player, are definitely the two primary writers. But um, everybody will bring their own musical um, pieces in. And sometimes, like, when I bring something in, it's more of a collaborative effort. But when David brings something in, for example, it's, it's a pretty orchestrated. There are definitely jam sections in what we do, so I think that's why we get lumped in. Not that we don't like it with the jam scene, but we also uh, do a lot of progressive style stuff, so it's very orchestrated um, as far as the hits and and uh, and how things are going to break down. Time change, signature yeah, changes, change, time key signatures changes. all over the yeah. place. So mm -hmm. yeah. that stuff's all planned out. But yeah, like you said, there are jam sections in most of our songs. Yeah, yeah. yeah. you're going to do one song for us called Tugboat, mm -hmm. right? That yeah. has a lot of things going on musically, composition yeah, wise. Yeah, a lot of orchestrated, but also a big jam section in that yeah, one as well. Yeah, yeah. So it comes back to the orchestration, yeah. of course. So you're on the road now, and uh, you had a little mishap today. I think, right? <laughs> what uh, which one? <laughs> <laughs> no, uh, it, nothing big, you know. Uh, when you're on the road, you're, you're constantly battling the, the uh, wear and tear on your vehicles, your trailer, your instruments. So yeah. today it's when we woke up... It really isn't that yeah, bad. Yeah, it's not, bad, not that big of a deal. We've had your horrible things. Your van broke things. down? Is that, uh, is just, that it It's leaking some oil, and we, had, we came out... It was, it was actually a combination of things. We, we found a lump in the side of the tires, so we were like, okay, we got to replace the tires. And we saw, saw that it was dripping oil, and we're like, oh, uh, all right, got to figure out what's going on there. And then I hopped in, and the the back tail light wasn't working. I was like, ha, got to figure that out, too. <laughs> so, uh, but it's all good. Sound like you have the right spirit about this. <laughs> all right. Well, we've been in, sitting on the side of the road so many times, you know, just we've, like we're yeah. just used to it. We're yeah. immune. We've know? flipped the trailer the before somewhere. and oh, unloaded yeah. it, flipped it back over, hooked it back up to the bus, loaded everything back in, drove to the show, played, played the show. Wow. So. <laughs> <laughs> Very good. Well, I'll tell you what. Um, when you watch these videos at home, make sure you clear out your space because you're going to want to dance and you're going to want to <laughs> do something. This is a lot of fun, and uh, you're going to enjoy it. So watch the performance videos. This is Second Story Garage.